Hello. Good to see you. All right there, Revenants. Welcome back to Code Vein and the Road to 100. Welcome to episode 183, where uh, uh, we f <laughs> we find ourselves in the city of the Falling Flame, and this is probably one of the most favorite places for me to be in the game. It's uh, one of the most broken setups, it's one of the most broken places, and it's one of the most enjoyable, fun places in the entire game to actually play. Um, and uh, you'll see why as we go through here. So currently we have a 52 uh, fire resistance, and uh, if we go for uh, a couple of things here, Thanks. and uh, let's uh, go ahead and get ourselves uh, going here. And I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, and then we'll do this. And this is just to uh, get our flame resistance going. And now we're we're at 202. <laughs> Absolutely broken. Oh my goodness. And if we go for our bridge to glory, for that we get our pipe up to 2675 at a value here of 2947. And if we get focused, uh, we get even more. Uh, so as we uh, <laughs> as we go through here, um, uh, basically everybody dies in like two hits or, or three hits. And uh, also we will uh, have immense, immense amount of damage um, out on the enemy while at the same time uh, we will have uh, the ability to kind of just wander around and, and take hits whenever we want. So this kind of extreme fire resistance, we will have uh, basically invincibility against the uh, fire, flame atronax in here. And uh, so we can do really, really, really well against them as well. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and uh, get it started here. Alright, and we'll uh, save, our, save our life and everything for a, a little bit later. Um, we'll go ahead and go for a, a drain activator now. And you'll see, this isn't even our final form. And, uh, um, yeah, Eva's just going to run over these guys because they're weak to blood as well. Um, but, uh, and this is this is kind of our average form here at uh, 1463. So it's about, uh, a little bit about, a little bit above half of what we were doing uh, at the full, at the full version. But also we're going to have to be careful because um, we are uh, going to be needing to get focused here and there. Um, and that's going to be a real problem. Uh, but, uh, okay, we got hit by that guy throwing knives back there. Okay. And we'll go ahead and beat this guy down. And beat that guy down. So it's good we got hit a little bit uh, because of um, uh, survival instinct. But uh, not good because uh, we definitely don't want to make a habit of getting uh, damaged here and there. And this guy, he can't, he can't hurt us. And remember, we want to, we want to get focused. So we'll encourage him to hit us again. There we go. We're almost uh, focused. Hit me. Oh no. Okay, so we're almost focused there. Now we got monkeys over here, and we can end monkeys uh, very, very easily here. And I love hearing the pipe clink into their skull and knowing that they are going to be uh, ruined. There we go. Now we're focused. There we go. And now uh, that brings us up uh, about 400 more uh, damage. <laughs> uh, so yeah, and then when that's paired with Eva, it'll go up even more to about about another thousand damage uh, that we'll get out of it. So, so during the kitty fight, uh, you'll see exactly what that'll go to. Uh, because we will um, be uh, we will be in a really really good way there, so we're still not down to 50% health, which is okay. Now this guy we can uh, definitely load up on some Icor here from him, because uh, we need quite a bit uh, as we go through here. Let's go ahead and switch uh, pipes. Oh, he's gonna kill Eva. Okay, let's slap him down. Okay. And uh, let's head on over here and pick up some of these fellas. Yep. Okay. Now we uh, bridge to glory is over, so all we needed to do is go for um, go for backstabs now. There we go. Whoops. There we go. And let's go for flame protection, so we can go for a uh, another backstab here without killing. There we go. Because we need to uh, go for. Um, all of our uh, 
all of our gifts during the uh, Flame Atronach fight. Whoops. Now we are down below ha half health for sure. So that's uh, good to uh, get ourselves to that to that level so we can uh, go against him uh, hard. Because uh, it's going to be uh, really, really bad for us against him. So we'll uh, try and uh, keep our health where it is right now. While at the same time uh, going for uh, some good defenses here. And uh, getting some backstabs along the way to make sure that we uh, have have just enough... Uh, just enough I4 for uh, everything here, and uh, because it will be very, very expensive to uh, go uh, for all all out on our uh, on our gifts for that fight, because he uh, can ruin us and end us uh, very, very fast. Let's go for a gift extension just so we make sure that we have our flame protection here as much as possible. So this is just uh, setting up uh, for that fight uh, with, with the Flame Atronach, as he is uh, very, very bad. Uh, he's, a, he's a very big meanie, and uh, we need to show him who's boss here. Okay, so as we come through this area, uh, we will, we will uh, come up to him right now. And uh, it's good that some of our gifts are ending, but uh, everything is reset after this cutscene for whatever reason. I don't know why. Okay. Um, but uh, I just love, 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 love this setup, love this build, love this area. Um, it's it's uh, probably my favorite in the entire game, uh, just because you can uh, tailor it so well and so easily uh, to to what you need it to be and how you want it to be. Um, it's just such a fan fantastic place because of the flame, and uh, everybody kind of does their flame damage and everything. Uh, good water. So you're able to kind of mitigate that easily and quickly and simply. Um, so it's it's a lot of fun. I, I love going through here. Okay, so let's go, go ahead and get ourselves going for uh, the fight here. Okay, and uh, we don't have enough, so we'll go ahead and do this and we'll heal one and we'll go for this and we'll heal one and then we'll do this. Good. Now we are at below half health. We'll go for Eva now. And now we'll go for this, and this, and we're going to get focused uh, most likely because we're going to be uh, getting smashed in the face so much. And you can see here that we're uh, back up to our full self, and we will go for um, uh, some of our items here, uh, like this, and hopefully we get a hit. Oh, 116. <laughs> and there we go. Now we're focused. Uh, so if we can get a, a view here of our, uh, of our value, 3293. Okay, and we'll just uh, go ahead and beat him down. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, there you go. Um, um, elemental wall ended uh, in um, barely enough time there for us to uh, get get out of there. Okay, and uh, let's see, what's our value? Twenty six seventy five. So if we do uh, one of these guys, and then we go for some I core. There we go. And we'll go for one more. So you can see that uh, you can be invincible completely versus the uh, the flame Atronax. and uh, it's really good if you uh, if you do because um, you are able to completely ruin the guy uh, very very quickly. So I wish um, that uh, Severing Abyss would have uh, connected there. That would have been so nice if it would have, uh, but it didn't. So whatever. And just beat the monkeys down. Okay. And uh, they're hitting us because elemental wall is over. That's, uh, that's a bad thing. There we go. And now that we're we're going to run over here, we're able to kind of put these guys down. And now that this guy's down, uh, we can go for a Severing Abyss. And you can see there that it has uh, huge amounts of damage. 16,000 is a fantastic amount of damage uh, for the pipe. And if that other one would have connected with the Flame Atronach, we would have probably done about 25,000, 30,000 uh, damage uh, to him. And he would have uh, probably died in one Severing Abyss plus, uh, plus, a couple of, plus a couple of attacks. Okay, so now as we got to wait for our items here, or our uh, gifts, and uh, we definitely need to wait for this guy, we will switch to the Lightning Pipe. Okay. And we'll go for a backstab here. Now we're losing a little bit of health, 
uh, because elemental wall is over, so we'll go for that, and that'll uh, uh, put us right back on top here to the invincible. And since uh, since we are uh, or since the uh, balls up here uh, are in our face, we don't want any balls in our face, but they are weak to uh, crush, and so just a couple of slaps, and uh, the balls go down. The balls go down hard. Okay, and uh, if we get hit, remember, and we get focused, uh, or if we dodge and get focused, we get more flame resistance because of uh, elemental wall, and we get uh, more damage out on our pipe. Uh, so it's it's in our best interest to dodge and take damage uh, where possible, and it just makes for a fantastically fun uh, way to go through here. Okay, let's slap all these guys. All right, watch out, Eva. Okay, we'll go for the lightning pipe. Okay, never mind. Yep. Okay, we'll go for Elemental Wall, and we'll go for uh, Cognitive Zeal, just to get uh, more uh, more resistance. Uh, now, for the second Flame Atronach here, we are not going to have, obviously, our uh, amazing um, uh, Icor amount, uh, unless we Pure Blood up and uh, go for some of this. Uh, so we will definitely go ahead and heal, and we'll go for a couple of things here. We'll, we'll go for a couple of these here. There we go. And then let's uh, go ahead and pure blood. Uh, yeah. We'll go ahead and pure blood here. And we'll go for Eva. And we're going to have to be uh, a little bit careful here. Um, because uh, things are kind of ending. Uh, so it will, uh, you know, not uh, not be in a, a very fair fight here uh, at the beginning. So there we go. We got elemental wall. Now let's go. Come on, buddy. Okay. Now let's go ahead and slap him a bit. There we go, we're focused now. And let's see if we can get that Severing Abyss off while we're focused. There we go, 20, 21,000. That was uh, really good that uh, we could see that damage come out. Uh, that's fantastic. And let's go and just beat him down. There we go. So uh, it kind of makes uh, very, very quick work. Whoops, now we got balls in our face, uh, which is a really, really bad time. Eight. Nobody like uh, balls in their face, and uh, uh, what is that? Um, Bridge to Glory is over, so we do zero damage to balls. Um, no, no damage balls. Oh boy, oh boy, and uh, we could get staggered into the wall here, which could end us. There we go. Now that uh, now that we got Bridge to Glory back, uh, we can end these things in like two shots. There we go. So anytime you're playing with balls, you know it's just not uh, not a good time here in Bane. All right. And we'll go for a couple slaps. We'll go for some slaps there. Good. And uh, let's see. We uh, definitely... Uh, I think we have enough healing items and uh, such to go for the kitty outright. We found the crib. We'll just have to uh, wait for our cooldowns and such um, to make sure that uh, everything gets back up to full. Uh, so let's go ahead and see how uh, how far down... Uh, we can get here on our heels uh, while we wait for everything else to kind of um, drop uh, the cooldowns. Okay, and we'll go for uh, we'll go for one more heal. You look there we go, and we'll go for this, and we'll go for this, Thanks. and this, and Eva. Okay, and we'll go for this, 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 there we go. Now, uh, this should be, uh, I love this fight. Um, this is such a fun fight uh, with the kitty here, uh, simply because you can, you can just, <laughs> you can just beat her down and you get so much damage uh, from the build uh, because you're able to get focused here in the fight because she slaps you around pretty good. Um, and you can do uh, monstrous damage if you can land it from Severing Abyss, uh, while at the same time uh, being able to, um, you know, put out the damage on her. Oh, Bridge to Glory is over. There we go. Oh, we need Flame Protection. There we go. Okay, now we're going to be able to slap her around here. There we go. Now we're doing about 3,000 in attack. Oh, we need uh, Elemental Wall. Oh, we're dead. Eva? Right. There we go. Elemental wall, there we go. Okay, she's gonna kill Eva probably. Nope, not quite. Okay, she's gonna 
do that. We can go. Oh, see, that's the problem with it. Uh, um, what is that? Um, that's the problem with uh, severing a disc is you can't uh, ever uh, pre predict um, where she's gonna be. So uh, you're constantly having a hard time. Um, oh, we're focused now, so that's good. <laughs> there we go, and we'll finish her off. There we go. <laughs> Forty-four thousand. <000. laughs> Oh man, it's just such a good time here in the City of the Falling Flame. Um, it's it's always just so much fun uh, to uh, wreck this area, um, basically with a pipe. And uh, this this place in particular, if you ever wanted to play a pipe and you ever wanted to play um, kind of just willy nilly, you know, balls to the wall, uh, kill the balls, you know, do whatever you wanted. Um, just it's it's such a fantastic place. Uh, to make this happen, uh, because the only guys that can hit you are the regular lost fellas, and none of the other flaming anything can actually damage you. So it's it's really really great, um, to say the least. And uh, I'll have to go back and look at the focus part when uh, we got focused and see uh, what our flame resistance was, because as we get focused, we get more light value from light impulse, and uh, we get 30% more, which then goes into the 50% uh, more from Eva, and so then as things start multiplying, uh, you get very, 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 very high light value. As you saw, we were at almost 4,000, and uh, so the uh, uh, elemental wall scales off of your light value, and so uh, you can get really, 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 really high uh, elemental resistances just from elemental wall alone because of the scaling that it gets from the high, extremely high light value that we have. Um, and I'll have to go back and look at that. So I would encourage you to go back, uh, check the part where I got focused, look at the fire value uh, that we were resisting, and you'll see why we were invincible. And then as soon as Elemental Wall went away versus the Flame Atronic, uh, we, we took uh, just extreme amounts of damage and almost died there uh, instantly. So anyways, it's been a lot of fun here in the City of the Falling Flame. Thanks all for watching, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll be in the... Uh, um, crown of sand next i got some uh, fun things to do there and uh, some exciting uh, topics for that so thank you all for watching and we'll see you tomorrow